pump, complete system, 2,098 bucks. Meanwhile, local governments depend on property taxes to fund schools, police, and fire protection. But nine investigates discovered plenty of people are cheating the system and they're not being prosecuted. They claim homestead exemptions when they don't deserve them. And I learned it's costing local counties millions of dollars in lost revenue. An attorney owns this 3,600 square foot home in a gated Metro West golf community. But nine investigates learned he unlawfully benefited from a property tax break for years. Records show Julio Gil de la Madrid was double dipping, claiming a homestead exemption on this property and his home in Puerto Rico. So well, of course he home? should know better. In Florida, the exemption saves the average homeowner $700 a year in property taxes. To qualify, you must live in the home as your primary residence and cannot receive a residency-based exemption anywhere else. We're all doing our, our part to make a great community. If he's not doing his part, shame on him. Investigators with the Orange County Property Appraiser's Office determined Gil de la Madrid has been getting an exemption in Puerto Rico since 1993. Those that know how to play the game, play the game. Records show he owes more than $69,000 in taxes, penalties, and interest, and this lien was placed on his home. While from Puerto Rico shows Gil de la Madrid received an exemption, he told us he doesn't and asked Orange County exemption. But we found this bankruptcy filing showing he listed the exemption on his home in Puerto Rico. His case is more common than you think. We uncovered more than $4 million in unpaid taxes across Central Florida owed by people caught wrongfully claiming the exemption. And that's just for 2013 and 2014. That's a big problem. And although claiming dual homesteads is a crime... I don't know of anybody that's been prosecuted. Volusia County property appraiser Morgan Gilreath says proving a homeowner intended to cheat the system is difficult. Still, his investigators aggressively pursued tax cheats by discrediting improper homestead exemptions. But if you're getting one you don't deserve, someone else is having to pay higher taxes because of that. Now, if you don't pay your property taxes, your home can be sold out from under you by the tax collector in three years. Gilreath wants lawmakers to apply those same rules to homeowners who don't pay back taxes for undeserved homestead exemptions. As for La Madrid's case, the Orange County property appraiser told us that case is closed. We'll let you know if anything changes there.